All right, guys, today I am in Uricksville, Ohio, and um, I am back at a place that I filmed last year. This is actually a restaurant now. Um, it's got a lot of history. It actually used to be Virginia's Tea Room. Um, at one point, it was Famal Shoes. It was Curly Clothes, I think it was called. Some of you from the area might know uh, Rita McPeak. She was the one who, who has been uh, completely remodeling this with her family. And, uh, and and like I said, you know, I went in here about a year ago and filmed the whole thing. I will link that at the end. Um, pretty good video, actually. But she has it up for lease right now. And it is, it's, I mean, it's totally decked out inside. It's made up to be a restaurant. But what I want to show you today is what's going on around uh, the side here. And that is a big mural being painted on the entire side of the building now let me step back here a minute there you go you can see the entire side here now i just spoke with the lady up here who's doing the painting her name is Teresa prince and uh she explained to me everything that's going to be happening on the side of this building um i can't remember all of it unfortunately <laughs> basically she said it's going to take at least two summers to do she's obviously starting on the bottom here these are gonna just look like older businesses. Starting in the front here, where this looks like you're looking into the restaurant and you're gonna be able to see people eating in there. You can kind of see the shadowing where there's tables and people in the background there. And then these are gonna be modeled kind of after older businesses. She said there's gonna be signboards above. It's actually gonna have the names of like doctors um, that used to be in the area and businesses that used to be in the area. And uh, I think she said canopies. And then as you move up higher, there's gonna be like older architecture and a little bit of sky and clouds and that. So it really ought to be absolutely beautiful when it's done. You really have to see this in person to grasp the whole thing. Um, I mean, she is doing so much to put depth in there and shadowing in the right places and to make sure that, you know, when you're standing like right here, you can look down here and it looks the right way. And the same thing where you look down here, you see the inside of the bricks. There's a, a light edge there and then there's a dark band and then there's a light and then there's dark. Perspective, if you're standing over there, you would see that edge of the trim board, and then this is the front facing, so that's what creates the dimension of the trim board. I'm going to highlight the center part, and that'll raise it up, and then I'll be putting a, a dark black edge, and that'll make it look like it's the inside edge. This is just an absolutely enormous building already, so I can only imagine how long this is going to take, but I will definitely be down here to do updates as this comes along. Now let me take you around the back here for a minute and show you something else. Um, like I said, when Rita was redoing this, she had her whole family involved, her mom and her dad. And around the back here, uh, the same lady painted a little painting on the back that I thought was pretty cool. And this right here is a depiction of Rita's mom. <laughs> I thought that was pretty cool. Look, we got the little pupster here and, uh, and the robin. And then that's her mom just kind of watering the plants there, I guess. And then up in the front here on the side, uh, she said that they're going to have a depiction of Rita's dad also. Um, I think she said he's going to be up on a ladder or something. I honestly don't remember. Oh my gosh, she told me so much information here. <laughs> if you watch the other video that I made inside the building here, you will see where there is like a... I can't even think of what you call it. Almost like a, a decoupage wall where it's all older uh, newspaper articles and things. And uh, I think it was her mom that actually put that wall together or at least had the idea. So that was one thing that was really cool and stuck out to me on the inside of the building there. But yeah, I thought this was really cool. I thought I'd come down here and kind of look at it, see what's going on and, uh, and share it with you guys because it's just something cool that's happening in the community.